This is just one of the many trash piles around the apartment complex. It smells awful. And the nearby daycare says some people will come by and dump their trash. And some will even light it on fire. When you go to our playground, you just see mounds of trash and it's horrible smells. Chris Dukoski with the Little Inns Daycare says it's time to clean up the Creekside Apartments next door. The units near Southwest 59th and Agnew are owned by California-based Capital Homes Investment LLC and currently going through foreclosure. Koski says trash pickup stopped happening a few months ago, then people started burning it. The dumpsters got removed maybe two to three weeks ago uh, because of the fires. Um, the city doesn't come out to dump the trash, so I don't know who does it, but they come and set the trash on fire. Many still live at Creekside, rent free and without utilities. Many of the constituents don't have any other choice in this day of inflation. Democratic Representative Mickey Dollins has been advocating for his constituents there for a year. It's inhabitable, it's dangerous, and it's a health concern. Employees at the Little Lens Daycare say one of the trash fires actually damaged their playground equipment. I want them to have a better environment to be able to play in, to explore and have memorable good memories of playing outside, not those smells and not seeing that trash. But the garbage keeps piling up and the apartment owner Jose Bellman tells News 4 the problem with their trash account has been fixed. New bins should arrive Friday. The trash should really be completed no longer than Thursday just because of the amount. In Oklahoma City, Caitlin Ogle, Oklahoma's News 4.